It has a magic to it. It really has a charm. It reminds me a little bit of the Guggenheim Museum in the Santa Monica Hills in LA. And this house is really an art house. It lends itself to art and great furniture and really people who appreciate the finer things of life. It's just such a pleasure visiting this home at 10 Yarrowell Road in Kew, one of the most coveted spots in the Studley Park area. What's so lovely is driving up, you see nothing from the street. So it's only when you come to the top of the driveway that you see this wonderful white edifice. So it's such a hidden oasis. What I really admire about this house is the sense of arrival. You go through the portico, which is covered in ivy, and you walk into this atrium space and you just glimpse the sense of scale. And then you go through this lovely gallery space that kind of plays with your sense of space. It's slightly compressed and then again it's released. So you see this wonderful picture window and you're greeted with the swimming pool at the top of the stairs. So it's been very well considered, very well designed and different. It's very different. There aren't a lot of houses of this period and it is actually getting stronger architecturally in terms of fashion. People are actually looking for houses of the 80s and 90s now and seeing them in a new light. And I think this house really lends itself to entertaining on the very grand scale. The living areas are quite sublime. It's all open, there's a sense of transparency. So even though it's a large house, things seem to be very fluid. So you can look through to terraces, dining areas, the lovely picture windows that literally frame every aspect of this property. There's very well-conceived family areas for children, for adults. It's broken up into wings. There's a self-contained apartment, really quite large with its own separate entrance. And then you have a parent's wing that gives you that sense of seclusion with its own office next door and walk-in dressing room. And then you have this lovely split level dining and lounge area. The bathrooms are pretty lavish, marble, en suites to most bedrooms. There seems to be a space for everything. The garden's quite extraordinary. It's very established. And so there's complete privacy all around. But there's also lovely nooks within the garden. And it's lovely because there's a space for everyone. You've just got so many wonderful views here. The established trees, the lovely dappled light on the ceiling made from the swimming pool. I also love the way the terraces wrap around the entire house. You can see city views, you can see garden views, you can see views of the neighbourhood. So it'd be a great place to have New Year's Eve parties, great place to just enjoy the sunset, but really just enjoy the luxury of space that this house really affords because it is extraordinary in terms of its size and the way it was built. It's just a wonderful home that I think will give the new owners pleasure for many, many years to come.